Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be um, doing a little quick, quick get ready with me. Um, I washed my hair last night. Um, I'm just gonna do a little quick fix here because I have um, a party to go to. So first, I like to brush my hair. Make sure there's no sand bubbles. So that way, later on when we're trying to flip this mask. However, I must admit that last night I got home at 2 a.m. went out for my girlfriend's bachelorette party. So I just washed my hair and really didn't put any product in it. So I look like that too fresh. So I'm gonna preheat my um again go through it make sure everything is really untangled then I like to start from right here and then I know that there's people that do it like away from the face or whatever girl I'll just do it whatever way I don't mind I don't care as long as things get done quickly I'm out the door in less than an hour. I'm good. Still gotta put a face on. Might not have lash glue all over my damn eyelashes. I was gonna take that off, but I was like, what's the freaking point if I'm gonna put lashes on again right now? Like, I have to do it that all over again. I didn't. I usually I'm really good about that. Like, I'll take a take the eye got eyelash glue off as soon as I get home. But since I got home like at 2 a.m. Like, mm -mm. It was a wild night, let me tell you that. I'm trying to put a vlog on, um, up, I mean, about the wild night. <laughs> I'm so excited, the wedding is next week. Still have to go pick up my dress because I have to do some alterations in the top area. Because even though I'm like, I'm a, I'm a pretty big girl. Always been a big girl since day one. I was born weighing 11 pounds. Yep. My poor mother is five feet, bro. Five feet. But she made it happen. I would consider myself. What do I call myself? I'm not like fat, but I'm not thick either. I'm like. I would say like in the in the middle. I mean, I for sure got it some. Oh, that looks fabulous! I have some extra pounds on me. Mm -hmm. Plenty of them. But um, you know what? As long as you're comfortable and you are healthy, I mean, being overweight is not healthy. But as long as you watch your diet, which I really try to. 
background. As long as I don't gain weight, I'm good. <laughs> you know what? I like the way that I look. I have um, accepted this, the fact that I'm always going to be a big girl. And um, that's pretty much it. At one point, I was really skinny and I did not like how I looked. I looked like a damn bubble head. A bubble. A bubble. You know what I mean. The ones that do like this. Just the head. Mm -mm. No, honey, no. Alright, so I did half of the head. So we're going to go to the other side. And we're looking pretty cute. I had to get my hair done too. Then I'm going to go to the other side. I'm not going to bore you guys. I'm going to do the same thing. And then I'm going to show you how I do it on top. So I'll be back with that. Alright, so I'm done with the bottom. We're looking cute. And then we're going to come back to the bottom later on when we're done with the top. We're going to use a straightener. Because I like to straighten the... Um, the ends so it look, gives you more of like an edgy look so now we're gonna go to the top sorry if you can really see the top guys so I'm just gonna scooch a little bit down so I like to grab little sections like this and then I twist this back up oh, do it correctly please twist it back up grab again or little thingy here and then yeah we look fabulous it's fine grab the brush again I'm sorry if you hear the AC on it's starting to get hot here in Jersey so that's that so grab here a thingy I pretty much like to count one two three and uh, so we don't damage the hair that much. One, two, three. Or oh, one, two, three, up to five to be honest, depending on the thickness of the, um, the hair strand that I grabbed. See, it's just giving us like a little bit of volume, nothing exaggerated. It kind of looks a little bit like wavy and natural a little bit at the same time. Alright, so we're done here with this side. Then we're going to continue the same process so what I like to do is so we don't get we don't mix up the hair with the other hair I just don't drop your damn thing though just grab this put the hair here on the little clip and then we're going to continue on back again same process all over and over and over <coughs> wow that looks amazing fabulous I love it we're living for it It's just like a you know what if it was on it would freaking help There you go. Hmm. 
So when, when I'm done with this, I like to grab the um, a straightener and just like fix all the little flyaways and um, get things looking a little bit more smooth and clean. So I'm going to continue with the same process. I don't, I don't want to bore you guys and then I'll show you what I do afterwards. All right. All right. So now that I finished everything, this is how we are looking. So first of all, let me just tell you all that I am dying. It's so damn hot in here. <sighs> Kill me. Um, yeah. So let's get started with this. So I have here my Conair, my Conair, my uh, Chi. Ionic little thing, whatever you want to call it, and I just like like to go over the top, so everything looks a little bit more um, put together. Just all over the top of the hair. And then also here, like with the bangs, just so they're a little bit more cute. See, so they're a little bit more like... as well I just do it like like till here just a little bit Decent. Right. So I'm just gonna do this little piece here and then just like that. Alright, so now I'm gonna go to the ends. So I just like to grab them like this and then just go over them. So it gives it like more of like a edgy look. Like, like look at this versus this. Like, yes, girl. I feel like Erica Costell. I love her. I love the new song. What is it, Queen? Okay, that is good. Now we're going to do the other side, and I'm going to show you guys what product I use for the finishing touch. All right, so now that um, we are done with that, I have a little bit here of um, my, um, it's a 10 Miracle Styling Serum. I like to grab a little bit of this. Just like, well, first of all, open it. Like one, two little pumps. Just, 
I like to warm it up. I don't know if that's stupid or what, but I just go over everything just to make sure that everything is like flyaways or whatever. And then at the bottom, I like to do this because it makes it look a little bit more, like I said, edgy. Then, because I still have some leftover, I'm just gonna do one for the other side because it's like less here. Everything's starting to look a little bit more put together. And then whatever is left over. I just like to do this here. And then just do this. Give a little bit more volume. As well as a good head massage. And um I'm gonna put a little bit of this um So Purology um, Highlight Styling um, Texturizer, it's uh, sea salt, just to give it a little bit more um, little sea salt, does it hurt anybody? So this is the um, finished product. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Um, yeah, just a little beachy, cute moment. Yeah. So don't forget to um, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope that everybody has an amazing week, weekend, wherever it is. So peace and love. That sounded so cheesy.